All right, let's pop a beer and let's have it. Hello and welcome back to Seven Days to Die. I'm not only 2-5, and this is Brawl or Nothing. Because after all, you're my wonder brawl. That's right. Right, it's uh, day 10, which means in this series it's Horde Night. We've got a Horde to prepare for. And we are pretty well prepared from what I recall. Yeah, all this cobble is going to be put to use. And then we've got generator, an engine. Oh, that's right, we can make a motorcycle. We've got exactly 2,000 gas, so I'll just take half of that. And we'll need these over there. We'll grab our shovel and we will grab our claw hammer and our wire tool. That's a lot of stuff. Okay, let's get to work. So we don't want to build very close to this. Because I have been silly and not built a proper base. I've just got storage boxes out on the floor. And zombies will wreck them. If given the opportunity. So I don't know, why don't we just come back here somewhere. I think here's fine. I think we should be far enough away where it should not be an issue anymore. Okay, let's make loads of wood frames. And I've got a very basic idea in mind. Oh no, I do not like that. Things are floating more. And the ground's not getting pulled up. I've noticed this happening more and more. We're going to have to build it over here and dig out the ground because it just looks stupid. You get away from my bike. Oh, we've got two skill points. I guess it makes sense to level pain tolerance next. It's going to help us out the most, I think. This thing has been ribbing itself against a cactus. That's why it's missing 24 hit points. I'm just laying some foundations. I promise I will explain the design and stuff in a minute. Now right, that's the basic foundation. All will become clear. Now we need to build the base itself. And then we'll do ramps in these corners here. And that's just so the zombies continue to run past. And don't get hung up too much, in theory. Okay, let's get this upgraded now. I felt a stutter. It's a wandering horde, I see them. Let's round them up. Oh, these spiders are annoying. Go away. Ow! I haven't played for a few days. I feel really rusty. I'm getting hit so much. And the knuckles do not feel as powerful as I remember. It's taken so many hits just to take down these big mamas. I'm getting nowhere near the level of decaps as I say that I get one. It's making me nervous for Horde Knight. I see a steak and potato. Um, we've got an airdrop to get. We might as well get it. Though we've been disturbed. Oh, we did get another skill point though. Pain tolerance. Less chance to get stunned. Reduce HP loss. I like it. Imagine if this is like building materials in here now. I'm expecting a vulture incoming any moment because I'm... Yeah, there it is. Right on cue. Alright, see, I stood perfectly still there. So, in the comments before, I was talking about how I hated the vultures because you stand still, they dodge out of the way of your crosshairs, and it's really cheesy programming. Somebody said, no, 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 they're just recalculating their flight path because you're moving around. And I thought, oh, fair enough. You know, that's, you know, that must be hard to code. I was stood perfectly still then. Vulture felt the uh, crosshairs over it, moved away. I did not move in the slightest. Well, farmer bonus bundle. Well, all right. It was junk of me. Uh, let's eat this corn and the cob and cornbread and stuff. And let's drink a little golden rod or two. There we go. That cloth armor is actually pretty good. We had some quality one garbage on. We will eventually switch over to heavy. But not for a while yet. We need to max up fortitude first and every skill point within it. I'm going to a quest here. Not where I need to go. I'm running out of time here, so I need to crack on now.
Okay, my thinking is I'm going to stick a fence post here and a fence post, yeah, here. And that's going to trap the zombies and I can reach them and repair them. Only difficulty is getting these walled off because I would love them to be walled off. Um, so I'm just figuring that out at the moment. But yeah, we're more or less there. Let's uh, finish getting this top section graded. Uh, well, actually, let's figure this out first. Yeah, so I'm just digging down here, putting a pole going straight up, and that's going to cover that there. And then we can have blocks there like that. That's fine by me. Now I know what I'm doing with that, let's get upgraded. Alright, stairs are in, so they're going to jump up here. They're going to come along here and they're going to get trapped in these fence posts so we're going to punch them here. I need to knock out these windows though, because that kind of negates the point. I'm in a rush. I'm going to at least get everything else up to wood here. Uh, these are most important. Well, I'm basically out of wood now, so what we've got is what we've got. Uh, we've got most of this upgrade. There's a few little spots that just make me a bit nervous. But we have to go with what we got. I've run out of time. I've actually had to... I mean, full transparency, I've had to up the time because I just had no time. I underestimated drastically how long this was going to take. But I had to... Um, about 7pm in game, I had to put the time up to two hour days just to buy myself a bit of time to get this done. Is that technically cheating? Maybe. Do I care? Not in the slightest. Let's put it up there. Doesn't really matter. Stick that in. Refuel you. Grab the wire tool. From you. To you. And then you to you. That gives us a nice... I'm turn it on, have I? Nope. The idea is the zombies come here and get zapped here. That simple. I did want to get a kind of viewing window right here. That's going to take ages. Alright, well, let's run back quickly, uh, grab any extra stuff we need from over here, and I'll try and knock out those windows before the horde starts. Okay, so we've got contact grenades, molotovs, we've got a magnum, a double barrel, a pistol, we've got the tack assault with a few rounds. The uh, main thing is we've got our beer, and we've got our knuckles. I think we're set there. And I've also grabbed this pickaxe, so we can have a go at knocking those windows out and see if that's any quicker. And sure, we will grab some coffee as well, why the hell not? Maybe, um, honey... Maybe some first aid kits. All right, we're cutting it really super fine now. Let's go. This bike's got stuff in, so I'm just gonna ditch it right here so it doesn't get destroyed. That generator's going on. Unbelievably, even with two hour days, everything, still didn't have time to do everything I wanted. Let's see if I get time just to knock these out really quickly here. Come on, come on. I want like a punching gallery here. Right, here we go. Nice. See, it works. Okay, we're going to have to go with what we've got now. Okay, I've just re-entered the game because I wanted the time down to 60 minutes. Yes, yes, cheaty, cheaty, whatever. Uh, so I might have just enough time to quickly grab this. Come on, power attacks, power attacks. Quickly, quickly. I want this base to be as I envision. No, stamina. You're just going to have to fry there a minute, zombies. I'm busy. There we go. Make sure we can repair our fence post. Yes, indeed. All right, let's pop a beer and let's have it. Whoa. I haven't done anything like this before. Wow. That's fun. Let's get rid of this, bring this down. Oh, beautiful. So this is why I'd wanted this, because I wanted a pension gallery. And they had somewhere to filter to. I'm glad it seems to be working. I don't know how viable it'll be in the long term. But look how up close and personal we get to get with all the zombies. This beer plus 300% is really nice. Get rid of him. On up. I will pop another one. Wow. We're just wrecking the machines. I'm 
next chance we get, which is now pain tolerance. Boom, boom. All right. So we're actually game stage 45. A third of the way to demos already, and it's our first odd night. But I wouldn't be surprised to see a cop or something here tonight. Maybe. You never know. So this horde night is not going to be easy. We've also got a dog. I haven't thought about how to deal with them. Oh, we can punch him right through here. That works for me. Where's that dog gone? Yeah, I don't normally get dogs on my first horde night. They're normally more of a day 14 thing. So the fact we're getting them, feeling a bit weak, we need a beer. Yeah, beer is key to this. It's key to this working. Because we got the book, where it no longer causes us to be blurry and dizzy and all that stuff. Beer is actually great. It's like plus 300% to brawling. But it's just made for this. Literally. Take that, Poochie. Huh. Oh, they're hurting me. They're hurting me. The big meanies. Oh, no. That's the worst thing. Leg is sprained. Well, okay. At least it's leg. How is this looking? Eh, I can do with a toucher. It's the dogs that are the most annoying thing. Get them on fire over there. Oh, yeah. And let's uh, get another beer buzz going. Oh, I want to get that dog. I want to get that dog. There we go. Yeah, luckily, I mean, dogs become more and more rare as the Horde Knights go on anyway. So it's not such a big deal. Just taking care of business. It sounds a bit quiet out there now. Uh, that was really good fun. I really enjoyed that. Uh, we've still got a couple more guys coming up. I think that might be everything. It sucks about the broken the broken leg. There we go. Uh, let's just grab our loot here. See nothing special there. Ooh, steroids are good. I'm hoping for a plaster cast in one of these. They sometimes give them to you in Horde Knight. Okay, more ammo. That's nice. Okay, cool. Just eat that. More loot down there. Ooh, quality six fire axe. That's pretty nice. Grab that brass. I would just drink the gold rod. More beer. That's always good. Wooden bow. We do not need. I guess we'll just eat these things. Uh, I can drop this clay. Eat that. Take that. And two more. More of that stuff. And uh, we don't need no blood bugs. Fantastic fun. Really enjoyed that. So I think that's the defense. I think we've got the basics of it down. Just a punching gallery. I think we'll call that the punching gallery. Or the brawling gallery. Hey, okay, home, sweet home. Uh, we don't have any plaster casts, so we'll use a splint. Oh, I had a plaster cast in my bike. Um, we might as well use that on top of the splint, because it will cut that time right down. And splints are easy enough to come by. There we go. Much better. But do you remember all that wood chopping we did? I've got 17 wood left. So I think next, I think we're going to start going into living off the land and we'll get a farm going. That seems like a plan to me. 
I think I'm gonna slowly cycle towards this next quest. Ooh, wow. Quality 6 scrap armor in there. Could come in handy. Ooh, and a quality 6 stone shovel. I like that. Two glue in there. I'm getting all this great loot. Better loot than Horde Light here. Alright, we're going to leave that one right there then. So thank you so much for joining me. Really hope you enjoyed yourself. If you did, please do let me know by leaving a like down below. If you'd like to see more content on the channel, why not subscribe today? Thank you so much. Have a good one. And I will catch you in the next one. Bye-bye.